It's not the moral framework that makes me fall in love with something and to say, oh, that's exciting. Maybe I'm too nerdy, but like the history part of it, I mean, the Christian faith makes historical claims. Yes. Right? And like the Judeo Christian faith, as, as you were talking about, you know, your partner talking about the biblical findings, whether they were there or not, they're historic. It's not a theoretical claim, it's a historical claim. So to me, that's exciting, whether you can prove or disprove it, or whether, you know, what percentage of it's making sense. And Jesus, the fact he was a man who died is not really negotiable, but the fact that the resurrection is kind of a totally up for debate kind of a thing, right? So, so to me, that's exciting. And, and the notion of whether there could be a God and the notion of evil also is interesting to me. So going back to this notion of morality, Jaspers, mm. I think to me, it's almost like, I think of it almost like um, stained glass windows at a church. Like from the outside, you're like, that's dumb, it's all black. Why would you have black windows? And from the inside, it's like, dude, it's gorgeous. And so now I see the purpose of them. So it's, you know, the light kind of is designed so you can see through it when the sun shines from the inside. So that's what I think of morality is like, if you kind of buy into it based on some truths, there's a reason how things work. And, and to me, that's, that's how I would kind of go backwards. Like somehow morality doesn't excite me to get into it in the first place. Can you say, can I yeah. Yeah. maybe ask a question? So when you say that God is the best explanation of <laughs> the entire sort of package, not, yeah. just the, yeah. not just the physical world, yeah. what are these other worlds that you're talking about? Because yeah. for instance, one of the most common arguments that I hear for belief in God is that God explains the moral facts. There are um, things that are right or wrong. I see. Right? Yeah. And the best explanation for these objective moral facts is a deity, yeah, you know, that commands us to behave in particular ways. Yeah, right. To me, that, I'm not, I'm not um, dismissing or emphasizing those arguments. It's just those arguments were never attracting to me. That's it. Right. So I think it's partly because I'm an idiot. Like when it comes to that, I'm like, ah. I mean, in other words, like great minds have thought about those things and wrestled with it, and I feel like it's just beyond me to play that game and to understand it. But um, some things that are exciting to me is the notion of justice. Like the fact that we all kind of burn, like this is going back to like if you've watched 12 Years a Slave or, you know, The Godfather, there's this notion of like you want things set right. Like there are like a thousand movies about some guy's daughter getting kidnapped and he kills everybody to get her back. You know, like every year there's like three movies. I don't know, I've never seen any of them, but I can totally imagine the, the reason why that's exciting. It's like, you know, this notion of vengeance to set things right. And, and the Christian faith really says, dude, that's a big deal. That's like a huge part of the Christian faith is the resetting of justice happening, partly for the notion of evil. I mean, like the punchline of the Christian faith is Jesus somehow is setting the world right through all this evil that, that has been happening. So I think like things like that about the notion of justice, the notion of why we find things beautiful, the notion of why, why we'd rather be at a rock concert rather than listening to a CD, right? It's like you want to be in a, you want to be in a community of people. Right? And one answer could be, well, that's evolutionarily the way we are. You know, we're community beings. That's totally fair to say. But the Christian faith also says we're built for community. So it's just kind of like eventually these probabilistic kind of things add up. So I kind of say this makes the most sense to me of all the things out there. <laughs>